The Cougar defense will face a significant challenge against the Cougars offense. Speaking of Washington State, there'll be plenty of pressure on BYU's defensive line to disrupt Washington State's wide open passing attack. True Blue's Brady Tucker shows us the fellas assigned to do just that in this Dexter and Dexter report. Size, strength, and speed. A typical defensive line requires these physical traits in epic proportions. But the most impressive quality of BYU's defensive line this season is experience. Well, the strength is uh, we got a lot of veteran guys back. Okay, um, you know, with Ian Doolan, we got Romney Fuma, Ethan, and Russell. Uh, all of those guys have started for me, you know, whether they were freshmen or part of their freshman year. We've all had the experience and we have a lot of, of wisdom in our um, different areas and in different positions. So in uh, the film room, we can just watch film together, things that we have to work on. The three seniors expected to start, Ethan Manumaliuna, Romney Fuga, and Ian Dulan, have played in a combined 110 games. Russell Tialavea is the only senior backup, but the other two backups have just 18 games of experience between them. Yeah, obviously, it's very important because it comes down to your execution. You know, if you know your alignment, your assignment, and you're executing, that's huge for us. You know, if you get that done, you know, and then play with phenomenal effort, uh, you know, then we're going to have success. Coach Kafusi is most concerned about depth at the nose tackle position, but says even though Tialavea has lost a lot of weight, he could back up Romney Fuga if necessary. The defensive line will look to pick up where it left off last season holding opponents to just over 100 yards rushing per game. Brady Tucker, BYU TV Sports. Thanks, Brady. That report brought to you by DexterLaw.com. Since 1995, more than 20,000 Utahns have entrusted their opportunities and challenges to Dexter & Dexter, a proud sponsor of BYU Sports. DexterLaw.com for help when you need it most.